The Rock returns after Roman Reigns and Cody Rhodes beat the Bloodline at Bad Blood. The main event of tonight's Bad Blood Premium Live event at the State Farm Arena in Atlanta, Georgia featured WWE Champion Cody Rhodes aligning with Roman Reigns for one night, only to do battle with the Bloodline's Solo Sokoa and Jacob Fatu. They created one hell of an atmosphere for this one. The match was about what you would expect from one involving the Bloodline. It was slow to start, and then got increasingly wild with various big spots, including a massive dive from Cody Rhodes to take Fatu out through the announcer's table on the outside. But the big spot came late when we did indeed get a major return. After Tama Tonga and Tonga Loa came out to help Sokoa take down Reigns, a hooded figure appeared. He super kicked the tag champs and distracted Solo enough to allow Roman to hit the spear. It was Jimmy USO. Reigns covered Sokoa and scored the win. After, Reigns embraced Jimmy to a huge pop. It was one hell of a moment. They turned their attention to Rhodes in the corner. The WWE champion stood, walked to the center of the ring, and they shared a moment of respect before Reigns started walking off with Jimmy. Naturally, the bloodline attacked Cody from behind. Jimmy asked his tribal chief what to do, and Reigns took them back to the ring to run Sokoa and his boys off. That left us with another moment, where Reigns picked up the WWE title and slowly handed it back to the man who took it from him at WrestleMania. Cody held it above his head. And then, The Rock's music hit. He walked out, stood near the entrance, raised the one, made a three, then slashed his throat. The message seemed clear enough. He's still coming for Rhodes at WrestleMania 41, or maybe someone else in the ring? 